Hello everybody, welcome back to more Enter the Gungeon Mod the Gungeon. Let's get weird reroll a run super fast movement speed corruption bomb better than average damage fine boss damage Holy moly rate of fire super up spread is a little bad reload times a little bad uh, Roll is actually Worse Yes roll is worse. I had to I had to process that as always, every single day, it's always with the bad, uh, always with the bad dodge, but that movement speed is killer, finally. Having that is being so good is really, really nice. 50% chance for enemies to explode violently on death. We are not immune to those explosions, but we also have the crazy, uh, the crazy space bar. Oh my god. But yeah, 50% chance means for this whole run, we really really want to stay away from the enemies there's gonna be a lot of situations where we can't really handle it like we can't really help it uh, we do have the ability to kill NPCs at this point which is a uh, you know which is something do we have an extra gun we don't this spacebar item is ridiculous I uh, borderline bonkers as hell OP uh, I like not even borderline it's just bonkers as hell OP we can kill NPCs to gain items and uh, we can also steal using it oh my god the kind of downside with it is every run I've had it our curse has kind of gotten out of control I don't know if I'm actually gonna I don't know if I'm actually gonna go do the uh, the dang jungle we'll see we'll see first of all we'll see if it's even possible it is okay I mean, we can use it as a this item as effectively a three times a room wild blank effect. We can use it to kill NPCs and thus steal their items. It's it's weird. At least you can steal the shopkeeper's items. Hmm. You can also break like shrines. I think, if I remember correctly, there's there's a lot you can do with it. It's a totally crazy item. One of the craziest. And that's saying something. We've had a lot of very strange, wacky, strong modded items. I don't know that many of them. Well, we do not. We do not want to stand close to these suckers. Okay, controller or uh, keyboard kind of just took control there. But yeah, as long as we are not in their in their face, I would actually. You know what? I'm just opening this. And I'm just opening it. If we can't go to the uh, the alt floor, we can't go to the alt floor. We gone, uh, we've gone a lot, you know. We went pretty recently. With distance, this item is amazing. The 50-50 explosion. Because it's like, it's a, it's a big explosion. <laughs> we might have got, you might have exploded after death. Those explosive guys are exploding it uh, twice. But it doesn't really matter is the thing. Oh, yo. Gun? No. Doesn't really matter. Zombie bullets. Do I feel the need to steal from them? We can kill him, but the items... Like, he drops an item too, but he... Like, I don't think it's worth the curse right now. Because we actually can't pick up the item he drops, which is a little weird. Basically, he, you get curse, he drops an item, you can steal from the shop. Uh, but only once? Which I, I think... I think only technically once. You can steal. Oh, oh no. Oh my. Oh no. Oh no. I had to. I had to. All right. Well, this is a different story now. Now we've cleared the floor, fight the boss, and maybe attempt to steal. This is this is now an entirely different story. If we don't get a key, I'm gonna steal. Bloop. God, our damage is amazing. It's nice to have, like, a, just a purely great run uh, rolled for us from the random run NPC. I mean, like, look at that. That is nuts, man. That was, like, one of the quickest first floor bosses we've, like, ever had. <laughs> I, wow. Okay, so no keys, so we gotta, we gotta steal it. Sorry, mister. You're gonna die.
I'm still confused about that. I mean, like, am, am I wrong to think, like, that this should be allowed? Am I wrong to think that? I think I might be wrong to think that. Oh, my God. It's even better. It, ju it just gets better and better. And we are out of here. Okay. Yeah, who needs the alt floors when we're this stacked already? Kill the shopkeeper. Kill everybody we see. We got five curse. We get one curse for killing the enemy. One curse. We still get the one curse for stealing. Uh, separately. So we gotta be careful there. Pop. Explosion immunity would go from an item that is, like, not that exciting in any way to very, very good today. No! I thought I got out of there in time. I thought I got out of there in time. But yeah, explosion immunity would be... Normally, I'd consider one of, like, the lowest tier things you can get. I'm gonna do this in here. It should be... Whoa! <laughs> Yeah, it should make the entire room crazy. Yes, it did. You... Oh my god, you better believe it did. Man, we've not seen this room in forever. Oh, you know why? Because I took it out of the mod uh, mod pack. I took this room... I, I deleted this room. That's why. I deleted this room from the, the room pack. And then I updated the, the room pack. That's why it's here. Low key. I'm gonna delete it again. You, you know, the, just because we're OP as hell today doesn't mean I want to see this room. It's still like it's it's an ammo sink room. It, at best, it's an ammo sink room. You know. Uh. <laughs> I dropped all the way up there. Okay, so there's the shopkeeper down there. We could actually kill the shopkeeper, steal the rat key. Man, like every gun is good right now. Is our what's rate of fire is better? Yeah. Oh my god, it's just all over the all over the place. We're OP. Every which way, we're bonkers strong. Thank you. Should I, I'm gonna go see if I should kill the shopkeeper again? If he's even still there. He is. Don't question it. Buy that key. can't do it unless we kill. We are already at 8 curse. <laughs> we are already at 8 curse. We almost were able to grab this. Which makes me feel even more like this is something that we can do. What's this synergy? Dawn of the gun dead. Okay, okay. Alright, well we are uh, super freaking cursed. We are interested in a uh, in a cleanse. Oh man, we keep on getting the one ammo back from the zombie bullets. That's pretty interesting. If we find that cleanse shrine, that would be top tier. Uh, I think maybe today we go to the fourth alt floor. The uh, the pen what is it beneath the permafrost? I can't remember what it's called. I can't remember. Like the jungle is easy because you just like just call it the freaking jungle, you know. I don't know what visually to call the other one. Like, I, I, I'd... Desert-y type thing? It's a desert-y type thing is what I would mostly consider it, but it's not the desert. In fact, like, because there was an Old West tile set that apparently is potentially going to be able to be restored, which is pretty cool. There's a, there's a Belly of the Beast alt floor in development. And, uh, I mean, that's just really, 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 really cool. Uh, some unused tile sets. Cool deal. Happy to have it. Some unused tile sets that have potentially been able to be recovered. Which may add full-on freaking alt floors to the game. Maybe even, maybe even two more. So we have the alt floor of the jungle, the alt floor of the beneath the, beneath the permafrost, I think it's called. I'm not even positive on that. This is... You know it's bad when you have to teleport to a room next to the room because the tell, like, you'll get there quicker. That's, you know that's rough. Uh, spring heal. Chamber gun. Ah, 
and just try one more time. You know I had to. Chamber Gun's amazing, though. I mean, I know we don't need to do it. I just kind of wanted to analyze it. Oh, okay. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, oh no. Number one villain. I just, I wanted to do it. It's a, it's a new one, I think. I've never seen it before, at the very least, so I think it was a new one added. Probably never names uh, pack here. Barbara, why are you scratching my chair? Barbara, please. Lilo. Oh. You embarrassed that I'm calling you your fake name on YouTube? Lilo, stop it. Please. Not in the middle of the video. I mean, already you've already destroyed my chair, so like I don't care about you doing it, but like... Don't do it during the video. Come here. Come here. Fight this boss with me. Come here, fight this boss. Barbara. Alright. Never mind. She does not want to fight the boss. She's scared of uh she's scared of Gunsnake Bad. Oh man, she's Reddit. My cat is Reddit. <laughs> Okay, um, this is not cl very clean, so we're making the floor really messy, Woo! very hard to see what is even happening, which is my bad, obviously, like for quote unquote needing to do it three times, but still. You know, I'm happy to see this gun. It's just... Why not, right? It's just... It doesn't matter if it's simple. I do kind of want to stitch it, though. <laughs> so... All right. What are we doing? We out? We out of here? Everybody go watch my new series on Blazing Beaks, by the way. If you've not seen it, I think you guys are going to be uh, very interested. It is a roguelike twin-stick shooter. <laughs> You guys don't want to watch Monster Train, but uh, you'll watch Blazing Beaks, I'm sure. It's uh, Enter the Gungeon slash Nuclear Throne, but everybody is birds, though. Go watch it. It's It's got... If you like risk-reward mechanics, like, if you like the thought of, uh, like... Basically, the, the base mechanic of the game that shows up a lot is screwing yourself over supremely so that you might get power. Uh, so, effectively... Hey, do you like spice in Enter the Gungeon? Do you like spice runs in Enter the Gungeon? Every run of Blazing Beaks is effectively a different type of spice run. So you should check it out if you're, if you're interested, if that appeals to you. If, if that doesn't sell you on Blazing Beaks on this freaking channel, I don't know what, it, what would because everybody wants me to do spice runs all the time. Hell, not only that, but it's if it's like if every run was a uh, was a different style of spice and clone run. I, as far as I'm aware, too, I think there's like, I, I believe. So I think that uh, you know, there we go. I think I've I think I've sold my pitch on that on that game there. I think you might be interested. And then if you want to help <laughs> help Rito play his, uh, it's probably going to be game of the year. On, on his channel, you can go check out Monster Train because that game is a v -v 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 very good. It is honestly like I played a lot of deck building roguelikes. I think that it may be the most me deck builder roguelike there is because it's effectively uh, it's a deck builder roguelike, but on top of it, you're doing like a tower defense or like okay you have three floors it's a deck builder roguelike but you have three floors and on each floor you're effectively playing a, a game of darkest dungeon you know does that does that make it clear kind of i don't know it's it's three floors and you're it's a tower defense you're trying to keep them from getting to the top and all three floors has a, a like a darkest dungeon fight and but it is a deck builder so I don't know, man. It is, like, aggressively me, and I love it so much. I hope you guys are willing to give it a uh, give it a shot. I, I really, really would love to be playing a lot of it. 
game of the year contender already. And it's like, it's not even out at the t like I'm recording this video on the 20th. The game comes out on the 21st. Game of the year contender already. It's it's so good. It's so good. You gotta watch out for these explodo boys. Things like this are actually scarier than normal. Hey! Actually scarier than normal there. Holy moly. Oh my god. Wait, what? The totem... Is it because we hit him while he was in his invincible form? And you can kill invincible things? And they drop items? Is that what happened? Because why else would we have gotten this glass wand stone? I'm not sure. Visually, this whole effect do does still kind of hurt my eyes. Like, a lot. Like, like quite a bit. Okay, so... These glitched fools are the ones who are dropping consumables. What the hell, man? Ay ay, ay ay, don't get it. But yeah. Oh my. Close your eyes, I am. Hey, like I wa always want to close, close my dang eyes when I uh, cast that item. But boy, it's very strong. Like, we would be doing our run a huge disservice by not using it. Man, what's up with the ammo issues here today? Hot cha cha, they're terrible. Terrible. So, apparently, we should try to catch him while he's uh, in Vinco Bill style. Eh, I don't know if we're going to be able to. Nope. Nope. All right, anything worth summoning the Lord of the Jammed over here? No, definitely not. I do love that he just keeps on coming back to life. That is uh, hilarious. It's like, don't mind me. Don't mind that you just killed me. I'm back. Oh my God. These suckers summoning on the first wave. Oh my God, I filled up that just because I was too frazzled. Them summoning on the first wave is pretty rough. Rat room, but we're not going to be going to the rat. No sree Bob. We're going to be saving our key. Gorgon is slapper. We're going to be saving our key. We're going to be going to the, uh, the beneath the permafrost floor. We do need the rat key for that. And then we also don't have to spend our key in blanks on this floor. Anyway, this is like a, like a bonus... Like a plus one. A little nice thing about it. Uh, I really don't know what to fill up as my secondary, so I'm going to say, huh! So I'm going to say, huh! Sure. Where? Okay. God dang. Zorgon, like all these guns that have crazy, uh, crazy high lock on and and uh, homing, I really dig them with high damage runs. This uh, Stone Dome, all them suckers with high damage, they're like my favorite to get because it's just like pure unadulterated value. Like every shot hits the target. Oh no. Rate of fire. Okay, wait. Gain a fire rate and reload speed bonus in exchange for negative knockback. No relation to actual mistake, though. These bullets were made by a hunchback, hunchback hermit living in, in uh, space, Albania, or something. Okay. Reload time is gets better. Rate of fire is better. Mm. For negative knockback, though. Not... Not only normal negative knockback, negative knockback on a run where we pull enemies into ourselves to explode. It's not, it doesn't, if I remember correctly, it does not do full on mistake bullet level knockback, or I'm sorry, reverse knockback. Uh, it sure seems like it might. That might just be because we have super high rate of fire. High rate of fire with negative knockback is not actually a good combo. 
we may have to drop these. Oh my god, ex ex even more explosions. Even more explosions, except this is an explosion that can't hurt us. As far as I'm aware. Oh, cash money. Cash money. Just It's just shaped like a freaking dollar bill sign, even though it don't have money in it, because I don't think you can script money. I don't think you can put money in as a guarantee. All right. The fun thing about the alt floor is we do get a skip to forge, so that'll actually be kind of handy, helpful. Oh, cartographer's ring. Don't mind if I do. What a wonderful phrase. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I need explosion immunity immediately. Or we need to switch to something like, like this that isn't rapid fire bullets. Oh my god. <laughs> this is terrible! Like, I like the rate of fire, obviously. And I will try to use this, like, a little bit. Gun Knight Greaves. Ah, that's perfect for our build. High synergy with this build. Because we're gonna get hit a lot. Okay, good to hit all these. Oh my god. This is something. So this is something. We may uh, we may need to drop mistake bullets, but like, I'll wait until we get hit a couple more times. Because the rate of fire is really good. But it is going to lend itself to ammo economy issues anyways, though. Unless it also gave us an ammo capacity up to go with it, which I don't think it did. Loving. Oh, my God. Yeah, these guys, though. These guys, though. Uh... Loving the stuns and everything we get from this. Loving the, uh, the zombie bullets. Zombie bullets. Oh. Okay. As long as we roll, we have to roll perfectly timed, like as they are getting to us. Ah, uh, ooh! We are going to the alt floor. That is amazing. Also, we can cheat this too. Is there anywhere we can like secretly? actually land I don't think so all right I'll do what I can okay it's been buffed it's been buffed apparently so I'm excited to see. Uh, I believe unstable strafe. Oh my! It has it. It has three shots, even though we have full health. That's nice. Oh, kind of like the shotgun blast with the the bullets that pull the <laughs> pull them towards me. Oh my god. But yeah, the uh, the bloody scarf has been changed too, so we you know we do we roll like normal. Oh my god. This is absolutely new ludicrous. But yeah, this new gilded hydra, I mean it's almost impossible to really genuinely tell how good it is. Because like this run is already bonkers. But it seems really good. Boy. And it'll be good against the, the... The Mistake Bullets won't be bad against... Oh, you like how I changed that halfway through the sentence? The Mistake Bullets won't be bad against the boss. They will just... They'll benefit us. And not hurt us. So that's something. 
I don't know what the hell to fill up. I guess I'll fill up the Gilded Hydro. Why not? Wee woo wee woo. I've never felt this feeling. I want ammo in the Gilded Hydra. Okay, maybe it still sucks. I mean, like, we have so much damage, and if it's not one-shot bopping. Rubidine. We, do, we are going to get a rainbow chest. Rubenstein's is very much a possible thing. You know what? This ain't too shabby. Especially if we, like, bounce it off the wall or something. Da, 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 da. Eh. It's not SAA, though. We have to actually, like, aim it. Oh, my chaos. Oh, my God. Booty bop boop. Where are you? Oh, freak out. Thank you. No, there's more. But wait, there's more. Yeah, we were able to get an item out of him, even though he... Or maybe even because he was in invincible. What the hell? What is this? What is this side room? This is abnormal. Usually there's not dead ends like this. The dungeon flow has changed, or what's up? Yeah, usually there's not just side rooms like this in the normal pathing generation. Okay. Step one, boss. Step two, cry. Step two, open up that sucker. Yeah, I love not pulling the boss towards us. What a simple, simple request it seems like. That's damage. That's some damage. I'm actually, like, kind of digging it in a way right now. We should definitely tap shoot, though. Wow. I mean, I know we have crazy damage, but it it seems pretty good. Omega bullets. Do you have anything with a... Uh, oh, yeah. Zorgun's really good with Omega bullets. Uh, I think I have a holster gets value from it. I'm not even positive, to be honest. Ain't even sure. Okay. There's a no-brainer we do it twice, and I'll do it more than that. This is a great time while we're doing this to remember to press the like button, baby. Oh, that's so smoothly integrated. He's a professional. This is a great time to do it. You have way more than enough time to press it before I uh, start playing the video game again. And there we go. All right. Beautiful. 319 is quite a bit. But yeah, this is this teleport in Lance Apache changed, which I really hope he didn't because it makes it really does. It's fun to take an item that normally sucks so bad. And then like it got buffed and now it's also like overpowered on this alt floor. I think it's nice. To, like, I, I get excited to see this item now. And I might get excited-ish to see Gilded Hydra now, too, since it's been buffed. Obviously, like, it's hard to judge today because we're busted. Obviously. We got 1.4 damage, which is pretty good. Like, it's we have a 40% damage up. It's not like we've been having some where we've been getting to, like, two times damage up, three times damage up, four times damage up. but 1.4 for, like, a vanilla Gungan run is really good. All right, all right, all right. Get through the door on the floor. Everybody rock the dinosaur! Okay. I mean, I'm for it. And look at, oh, my God, it's actually, and now it's, it's actually really, really good. Because we sacrificed all that HP. I didn't even process that. I'm glad that that effect is still there. Because it's like a... It's a clever effect. But the gun just wasn't good enough. To 
justify it. Like, justify its tier, rather. Alright. Oh, man. Thank you for giving me the map. Alright. We need to get the keys. Step one, before we do anything else. Let's go up here. Do this sucker. Anywhere we can cheaty teleport? No. It's fine. I don't really want to take my time. Oh, heck. I meant to do that. All right. Uh. Dang, nab it. Super close. No cigarette. Okay, so this is the uh, place that we teleport to, right? Oh my god, what the heck? Even with the map, I'm always confused. So we need a couple keys. Is there a shrine anywhere that has... Is that the cleansing pool? I would like to go down there. Yeah, this this floor is always so crazy. Like it's just visually, I just I even looking at the map, I'm lost somehow. Like I'm almost more okay. You know what? This is a floor to get rid of mistake bullets on. I I truly do think. Uh, right. Right? I don't know. I don't know. I feel like I'm, I'm always like, I'm always worried I'm taking away the fun thing, you know? Like, but then you're taking away our toys. Yeah, but like, this floor is already uh, finicky enough on average due to a lot of the enemies. How you can't really tell what they actually are. That uh, pulling them towards me and exploding them is also kind of a little spooky. Oh boy. Hup. If anybody wants to be a cool modder and wants to help old Rito McGee with cross promotion of series, you know what would be really cool? There's there's a lot of really, really cool guns in Blazing Beaks that I think would actually translate very well. Ring of Ammunition, Betrayer. He's just a small boy. He's just a small bulletkin boy. Creates a little bulletkin that will follow the player. Ring worn by a young bulletkin, inspired by the bullet, and betrayed his whole family. <laughs> Instead, it betrayed his whole kin to be a hero. He's too young to exploit dungeon by himself. He's glad to help Gungeoneers as a sidekick. So I think he's just a, he's just a familiar, right? Like, does he actually provide us with ammo or? Wait, do we? Can we? Is this? Hold up. Is this where we do it? I mean, if we could just, like, teleport over a wall, like, I'm not opposed. Yep. Where's my pet? Is he, what's he doing? Is he shoosting? He looks like he's shoosting. All right. No, this is, it is not the pathway. We did use a blank, which is, a. Uh, a problem. It's a problem. Okay. Man, I, I seriously think... You know what? I think getting the map made this more confusing for me somehow. Somehow. I am less sure of what's going on than before. Oh, God. Dang it! Dang Okay. 
Let's just get up to the shop. So we can buy goods and services. Okay. Out of ammo in that. Might be for the best. Do we have an... Oh. Okay. There, I, I, I thought that there was a potentially a version of this. I thought I remember seeing something in my Discord. Oh, that's right. He's the real one. Not the real one. So, yeah, it's like the Mimic Gun, but... It's like the Mimic Gun, but better. Oh. No, it's not, though, because it still has the Mimic effect. I can't believe I'm wasting all these blanks. I'm just terrified because my dodge roll sucks. And now we're not going to be able to do the floor, huh? We'll find a way. We'll find a way. If you open up your eyes. See what's inside. Okay. Oh. Wow. Wow. Thank you very much. You're a wonderful... Wonderful store. Yeah, we can't... We can't teleport all the way up there. But if we get flight, we can actually skip that. So, that's... We can skip the two keys. But it doesn't really matter if we skip the two keyholes. Because we don't need keys anyways. As soon as we get to the, the rainbow chest room... We can do the teleport. It's all good. From there, we're golden. Oh. Table tech table. Table tech table. Oh, mama. Hello. It's the manual one. <laughs> okay, that was satisfying. It's always up here. Is this is this the the one that can be? I, I feel like there's one path that can be completely ignored, and I think it might be this one. I could be wrong. We'll keep on clearing because I full clear everything anyway. Is what I freaking do. Ah, man, I'm sorry, little friend though. Is what I do. Pull him. Pull him. Pull! Oh. Oh, no. I got stuck in the wall. Unless... Okay. Next! Huh. Whoa, my... Golly gee. But yeah, this is, I think the shotgun is more... It's it's working out more with the mistake bullets. Because they just... They get pulled into one big blast and we can just dodge. Sideways. So I'm actually digging it a bit. Oh. Oh my. Oh my. We got our shots back in this though. It is fun to watch him hockey puck around, though. Okay. Slide in at a million miles an hour to the side of you. Was that my friend dying? Did my pet just die? Did my bullet kin pet just die? Oh, he's back. Okay, if, if he did, he's back now. Oh, my God. Damn it. I gotta do it, though. For the memes. <laughs> okay. Okay, this is getting rough. 
I think we bounce around, we throw this stuff. Uh, hell, let's throw this too, why not? Okay. Now, what have we learned? We learned that we don't have the keys. We gotta go up here. That's what we learned. I think. I think we learned that. I just need to get the the flight, which you get in uh, that room right there. If I get flight, I'm golden. I don't, that's all I need. I don't need to go and do the uh, the full-on key quest. I don't need to get them all. It's pretty irrelevant. Oh, yo. I'm actually going to fill up Gilded Hydra as my, uh, my choice. Oh. There are enemies over there. That is the truth. Isn't it through the chest room? I thought it was through the chest room, but that wouldn't make sense right here, would it? it doesn't. Oh, these are invisible. That's why. Key bulwark. Key fensive maneuver. Converts all your keys into armor upon entering a new floor. Every key converted gives a small permanent damage upgrade. Oh. Uh, I'm... I'm peeved with myself to an extent. But I'm also peeved... Do we... Do we have a way to do this? I mean, can we just... Uh, yes. Uh. 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 <laughs> okay. What's happening? Can I get over there? I, obviously, like, I know I need a blank or a shield. So what we'll do this legit first, and then worst comes to worst, I think I might do, it, do a little, little chi chi. See what this guy drops for us, Mr. Mimicklay Man. Uh-oh. That's not good. It just got hit scan. I don't know if we have, like, a good thing. There we go. Cheating. I like cheating. Oh! You decided no more cheating. Then you die. Where are you at? Yeah, I mean, this is a close range weapon. We might die to him today. He's not copying our, our weapons right now, so we can we can do these things. Because we have a lot of weapons that uh, would suck if he used them against us. Like, if I the second I see him actually pull out the stinger against us, I cry. Okay, switch it. Switch it. Go in a big old circle. Okay, and he switched. Now we switch back to our stinger. Stinger while we can. God, this the HP on this guy when he's jammed. In awe at the size of this lad's HP bar. Not a good one. Not a good one. Just trying to fill up my spacebar item. 
So I can use it to get rid of this one bee that's chasing me down. <laughs> this solitary bee that's chasing me. Am I hitting? Oh, he's moving. He's on the move. On the move. Oh my. It's a chunk of this fight. It's a chunker. I might die. I might die here. God, the hit scan. He switched so fast, too. God dang, man. This HP bar is... It's a... Ooh, it's a chore. Is he using my gun or the AK? He's using my gun. Shotgun, this is our time to shine. Oh my god. Alright, for the sake of the run, I'm going to lose. I'm going to lose here. But for the sake of the run, I will get myself pig so we can keep going and actually play the dang game after this. Alright. Oh, he's got a different one than me. Kind of. There we go. We might not need it. If I if I heal myself up, I'll you know drop it. I'll just keep the pig. Who cares? It's kind of like a uh, I don't want to use it, but I'll use it. Kind of a thing. Like I because I don't want the run to just be over and then they're like, ah heck, I guess we're done. Mimiclay. What to Mimiclay? Mistake bullets. Hilarious concept. As of right now, I would like to dupe our shield. Because then we can cheat our way into there. Low key. We're doing it. Not really cheating our way in, it's just like getting in there. Alright, um Okay, so we have one key. We need to get here. So therefore, if we set ourselves on fire. We fl we have flight. Uh okay. God, this is so messy. It didn't work. It did that didn't work. I want a refund. I'm actually so shocked that didn't work. Is there any way I can actually get in? I mean, all right. All right. I guess we have to do it from out here. We're, we're figuring out how this sucker works. Okay. So you have to do it from the outside. And we can't shoot at it until we're in. I gotcha. Weird, but okay. We're gonna freaking die. Oh, this run. Oh, mistake bullets. It's almost as if you're a total mistake and I will never pick you up again. It's not worth it. Not worth it. Especially not when you have an item that explodes them when they jump into your face. But I had to give it a shot, you know? That's what it's all about. You do the hokey pokey, you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. Alright, we got one key. We literally just need to come in here and get... We have flight! This is all irrelevant! This is all irrelevant. We have flight. There. Pretend that didn't happen. Pretend that didn't happen. In there, we can... It's, it's a cursed chest. I don't want to summon the Lord of the Jam. It would give us... Uh, if we did do it, it would give us... Whatchamacallit. 
Uh, the mustache is one thing. Ooh, gun knight. What's the other thing? When we get hit, we get armor there. That's pretty nice. Don't even know what this one is yet. Okay, let's snap up this other item here. This is the thing that gives us a speed up. Get the money. 50 coin. But I guess I do want to see shrine. We, I guess, the, okay, so we did not get the cleansing water shrine. All right, that's that was the other thing I was kind of hoping to find here. I guess we just don't get it. But we get the forge shop here. Locked bullets, damage based off keys. It's going to be pretty irrelevant at this point. I think we might be able to drop our cheat. Even though it's irrelevant, to, to, to get rid of it doesn't really matter. We get a dodge roll? What, what, what gave us a dodge roll? Our dodge roll is better. Is it is the space bar give us dodge roll up? Yeah, it does. I dig it. I dig it. Space bar gives us dodge roll up as well. That alone, it makes it pretty a pretty good uh, slapper for me here. All right. We got what we need. We can leave. Ah, yes. Samuel of the Pit Lord. Thank you very much. We don't need any of the bonus stuff. It's all, uh, it's all just fluff at this point. Off I go. That's right, they take away the Catkin throne. Off I go. All right. What a run, what a wild run. I can't believe we had actually didn't technically die. And the only cheating we did to get the blanks was unnecessary and just made us take a hit. <laughs> it didn't even help us. Like we cheated through the walls with the with the bloodied scarf, but that's something we would have been able to do anyways. And it didn't even really help us. Didn't, that's the more major thing. Oh yes, we got lucky with our uh, with our maps. Oh god. I like this room better with these with the RNG department enemies. Oh my god, we are so shielded. We got that item at a perfect time. The uh, keys for shields, like because it's obviously irrelevant. How's this gonna work? Poorly. Yeah. It's obviously irrelevant to have a whole bunch of them here. What a world. What a freaking world. A good gilded Hydra. Never thought I'd see the day. Oh my. Who did this? Never name. Who did this? <laughs> Who did this? Undo it. I love that. That was satisfying. Oh my god. Okay, so section on the bottom. The explosions. I do love we do have invincibility every time we get hit. That's one of the new item things that we did indeed get is whenever we get hit, we get a little bit of invincibility. Oh, that reflex. That was nice. Okay, and it gone. How much HP does this sucker have? I know he's buffed up, but dang, man. Hmm. Hmm. Down. Got flight, right? Yeah. Dang it, long. Yeah. Every one of these rooms that just has has those. It's like it's a completely different style of a room than like a base game room. So you just I'm just never prepared for it because it just isn't a normal room at all. Alright. Keep it up. 
Rail, gun, beep, bop, bop. Oh, poor man stuck in the wall. Game didn't like that. Game didn't like that. Oh, no, this is what the game didn't like. Oh, boy. Yeah. I'll cut my losses on that one. Kind of like what I did when I decided that having mistake bullets is an okay idea. I'm glad we did it now, so now I don't have to feel like I ever have to do it, really, very much. Because we can always... If I never have any video where I try out the item, then I'm like... Then I feel bad. Like, with certain items, like, uh... But now that we've... We've tried it. Oh my god, this is a terrible room for the 50-50 explosion. Terrible room for the 50-50 explosion. And I think we did find, like... The ultimate item it doesn't work with. Too. The ultimate item it just does not work with. Hip, 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 hip. If we had explosion immunity, maybe it'd be different. Okay, so this room should be less laggy now. Yep. Because that room that shoots all the bullets is what was lagging things up. So if we bounce it off the wall, they're not getting pulled towards us, right? It's hard to say because they're like getting dead. They're <laughs> just getting the dead. But it would theoretically it would make sense. Like they they would come from where the bullet was, not where I am. Right? That would make more oh my god. More sense. Thank you. Did we get the key bullets? The lock bullets? We did not. We did not. The, the ones that give us damage per keys. I I figured it didn't make a lot of sense since we had the item that uh, eight keys. I felt like it just would be kind of like, great. Here's a way where I can generate zero extra damage because we're not going to get a lot of keys on this floor. But then we got a lot. Uh, we got two keys on this floor. What do you freaking know? Oh, my God. All right. We've done it. We were able to do it without actually using the pig. And that is great. That makes me happy. I didn't want to have to use it. I never liked doing that. But I also know that it's kind of like a... It's kind of the middle ground between, like, the people who don't want me to cheat. But also don't want to see the episode end short. Is, like... Giving myself the pig, and every th if you want, if you want to care, you can say that. Oh god, that everything after the pig canonically didn't happen, but you know, didn't even die today. We got down to half a heart through a pretty spooky boss battle with the mimic, and then we were fine. All of this, well, we like. I, if we didn't have such good damage and stats, I don't. I think we would have died like the second we picked up the mimic bullets. Or the uh, no, 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 the uh, uh, mistake bullets. That's what I meant to say. We had a railgun. We can do. Uh, can use it still with this when it's on cooldown. It might be off cooldown now. Yep. Oh my god. Sorry to the photosensitive, like myself. We'll do it again on the next phase. I will tell you right now. We're gonna do it again on the third final phase. Big bang kaboom. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, that helps. Nope, not, not that either. Not that either, here comes the bees!
Bye, boy. Oh, my God. Crazy run. Crazy, 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 crazy run. Don't know what that was in the upper left. Holy moly. That is going to do it for today. Mistake bullets are a mistake. That is going to do it, though. After this, go check out the new series, Blazing Beaks. And hey, if you're feeling feisty and want to help Rito McGee play games he really, truly adores, go check out Monster Train. I would love it if that would stick around. Thank you for watching, though. Thank you, thank you. Extra special thank you to DX, Throbo, Nidalric, Justice Tom, The Shogun Gun, More Than Awesome, Semicolon P, and Patricia. For supporting on Patreon if you go Team Gungeon here. I never even looked at to, to see what this item did. Uh, but, yeah, thank you for watching. Thank you, thank you. These are our items. And I'll see you next time. Bye.